specs, I think. <laughs> Eat that shit. We're here. So Zyla's doctor is gonna check her skin after changing her milk to soy. And then, but she doesn't like soy. <laughs> she didn't drink soy. What did it She didn't drink soy milk. She doesn't like the smell. Yeah. So, so we're back here. We're back here <laughs> and we'll see what they're gonna do with her if they're gonna change it to Notramigen. Because she won't be checked by an allergist until she's a year old. So, we'll see. So, we're done. So, the doctor changed um, Xylus milk to Nitramigen. I don't know how you say it, but it looks like this one. She likes that one. <laughs> we hope that she's gonna like this one. She's gonna like the smell and the taste. Because if not, the doctor said we're gonna have to come back in a week or two weeks if she's gonna drink this one. And then he also prescribed a cream. What do you call the cream? Hylotopic lotion. Hylotopic lotion. He said it's an expensive lotion, it's about $500. But he said there's a coupon online that we can get. So we're hoping we could get that coupon so that it will be a whole lot cheaper. So we'll see and we're going to our next destination. lotion and it was originally priced if you can see that one it's 556.48 cents but if you've got that coupon that her pediatrician said if it's covered by your insurance then you're just gonna have to pay 35 bucks right yeah. and then if it's not covered like ours we just paid $75, so hopefully this will work with Xylus eczema. So this is how it looks like, or this is how the box looks like for Xylus um, cream for her eczema. If any one of you has tried this one for your babies, can you let us know? Oh. So this is the lotion. 